Hello, this is Masia Khan from Mechanical Simulation Corporation. Truxim offers methods to solve several VS math models in parallel, allowing for multiple vehicle simulations. This video covers the Truxim example series in which several tractor trailers are autonomously slipstreaming very closely behind one another, forming a platoon. Truck platooning can help optimize road activity and improve traffic, as well as reduce fuel consumption and CO2 emissions. Platooning is made possible through a combination of radar, camera, and GPS systems that allow the trucks to understand their environment and communicate with near zero response time. There are a number of control issues to consider when designing truck platooning strategies, including communication with the platoon, interactions with other vehicles, weather conditions, and other variables that may impact the driving environment. The examples in Truxim have a platoon of three tractor trailers navigating several scenarios. Each tractor trailer's behavior is calculated by its own solver running in parallel with the other two. This extension of the vehicles and math model allows simulations where ego vehicles interact autonomously. The parallel VS math model screen is used to collect the separate run controls for each ego vehicle and is the hub to launch the Simulink model as well as refresh parse files and sim files to update and run the simulation. The Simulink model holds each parallel solver in its own subsystem. Within each subsystem, the individual solvers, imports, and exports defined in the Truxim browser's models dataset are organized and connected together through the Simulink go to and from blocks. VehicleSim parallel math model examples are run within the Simulink environment. After running the simulation, the results for each vehicle's run can be viewed by clicking the V for video or P for plot next to its respective run control dataset link on the parallel math model screen. The fundamental platoon logic has the leading truck imitating a human driver in a test scenario, whether it be a braking test or simply driving at a steady cruise. The following platoon trucks are to autonomously maintain a safe distance from the preceding truck. The lead truck uses a path preview speed controller included on the procedure screen. This type of controller is meant to imitate a human driver following a path. It can limit the target speed based on curvature in the reference target path, combined with driver aggressiveness, skill parameters, and 3D road surface properties. The platooning behavior for the trailing trucks is defined with the truck's encoding language VS commands. These VS commands are linked for each trailing vehicle on the run control screens. Firstly, the commands define a different type of driving control. Instead of determining the target speed from the path geometry, the target speed is dependent on the speed of the platoon leader and the ego vehicle's displacement from its desired position in the platoon formation. A sensor on each platooning truck detects the behavior and distance of the truck ahead. These sensors can also distinguish between platooning trucks and other traffic vehicles. This represents a computer system that instantly communicates the behavior of the leading vehicle and controls the platooning vehicles accordingly. To test the platoon logic, several examples have been included. A brake test, a highway test, a double lane change handling test, and an intruder test. Each of these examples includes video and plot results to monitor the behavior of the platoon. The brake test has the platoon stopping from a cruising speed of 100 km per hour. The road includes markers to indicate the stopping distance. The double lane change test has the platoon performing the maneuver on a test road. The highway test has the platoon cruising at different speeds. And the intruder test has a vehicle intervening between the lead truck and the following truck. A vehicle sensor target is used to describe the behavior of this intruder. An additional VS command platooning logic has the following truck widen its target spacing to safely drive with the intruder. After the intruder leaves, the regular formation is reattained. Plotting the custom variable target delta shows the platoon adjust and reach their target distance during the intrusion. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video and would like to know more about vehicles and products, please click subscribe.